Would you like to know how I do that? Well, before I tell you everything, the tricks on doing that uh, on my mask, I will just tell you a brief information about the mask that we're using right now. This time pandemic, we all use masks, but which masks or what masks are the best to protect us against the viruses? Well, most of us, like 35 to 45% of the people, knew that we should wear this mask. This is actually designed to give you a full protection against the viruses because it's really sealed and it's really thick and it's really a uh, 95% filtration rate. You cannot even see this selling online and it's actually out of stock. Like, okay, fine, but what is the substitute against this mask? Well, I will tell you, we have this KN95 mask. This actually mimics a fact of N95 mask, which is a 3M branded mask. But what are the difference? Actually, there is no difference. The difference are the uh, manufacturer or the country of their origin. As we all know, 3M is actually an American branded mask. It's actually a NIO certified mask. Whilst these ones are manufactured in different country, but this is a CE certified mask, which is certified in the European Union. And if you will ask me, like for example, if I will go to Korea, like, and you saw this mask, they will not call this a KN95, they will call it in a different name, but same, it is the same effect. So, I do have a surgical mask. So, it really gives me a protection against viruses? Well, I can say, what I can say is, yes, it can give you protection against viruses. A surgical mask, especially three, uh, three play masks, uh, or have a 95% filtration rate, but it was designed as a loose fitting mask. You can see if you wear your mask like this, there's a hole on the side of the mask, which means the 0.3% microns, I mean 0.3 microns of the viruses can still enter your mask, and that means that it will not protect you fully against the viruses. And this mask has a lifespan of 8 hours less. That means if you use it a day, then you can throw it and use another mask again. So like for example, you will use 3 masks of this versus 1 mask of this. Google and according to the lip lip of 3M, you can use masks as long as the breathing resistance is not detected and it's not deteriorated and it's not damaged. So it means that you can still use your mask as long as there's no breathing resistance and cure. But in every rule, there's always an exception. You cannot do that in a hospital settings. In hospital settings, they always have their own protocol. And usually, and then ideally, you have to use one mask per patient. But how? How this surgical mask will really protect me against the viruses? And that's where my trick comes into. So anyhow, if you like and if you knew the trick, I hope you will share it to other people and to whoever uh, I actually saw this in video and whoever posted that video, uh, I credit to those person or he or she posted the video because without the knowledge that he or she shared, I wasn't able to share it with you as well guys. So anyhow, this is it. And all you have to do is to adjust your mask on your face. Thank you so 
much for watching. If you do like this video, please share it to your loved ones so they can protect as well and they can level up the use of their mask. And if you didn't subscribe yet, please subscribe down below and click the notification bell. If not, again, thank you for watching my video. Bye!